Didn't mean to come back in here. Alright. Now. Okay. Now, moving on. We'll continue down the path. Papyrus blocked earlier. Oh god, the white's coming back. And it's gone. Off we go. Mm hmm. Seems very damp in here. Dog, calm down. Sans. Yo, are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome. She's the coolest, right? I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. Haha. <laughs> Alright. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. It repeats it, yep. Okay, good talk. The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. That was a pretty weak one. What? Haven't you seen a guy with two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. I'm going to Grizzlebees. Wanna come? Yeah, sure. Well, if you insist, I'll pry myself away from my work. Over here. I know a shortcut. No? Damn. Fast shortcut, huh? Hey, everyone! Hey, Sans. Hi, Sans! Greetings, Sans. Hiya, Sansy. Hey, Sans. Weren't you just here for a breakfast a few minutes ago? No, I haven't had a breakfast in at least half an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. <laughs> George Costanza, everybody. Here, get comfy. This motherfucker. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on the seats. Anyway, let's order. What do you want? Burger. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Grillby, we'll have a double order of burg. So, what do you think of my brother? Cool. Of course he's cool. You'd be cool too if you wore that outfit every day. He'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Oh well, at least he washes it. And by that I mean he wears it in the shower. It's kind of weird. It's kind of weird. Here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? Sure. Bon appetit. You tip the ketchup. The cap falls off and all the ketchup in the bottle pours on your food. Whoops. Uh, forget about it. You can have mine. I'm not hungry anyway. Thanks, Sans. Anyway, cool or not, you have to agree Papyrus tries real hard. Like how he keeps trying to be part of the Royal Guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard and begged her to let him be in it. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. But the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's, uh... Still a work in progress. Great, good talk, good talk, yep, yep, yep. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. Yes, Sans. Um, have you ever heard of a talking flower? Uh, yes. So you know all about it. The echo flower. That's not what I was thinking of, but sure. They're all over the marsh. Say something to them, and they'll repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, Papyrus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes, when no one else is around, a flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predications. Weird, huh? Someone must be using an echo flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. What just happened here? Well, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away from work for that long. Oh, by the way, I'm a flat broke. Can you foot the bill? It's just what- oh my god. Uh, sure. Just kidding. Grillby, put it on my tab. By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. Oh, thanks. Um, great talk, great talk, great talk. Uh, what a just thrilling expedition. That's what's up here. Another house. Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. 
Ah, my patience rewards me. Ah. Ah. So anyway, ah, to be young again, the world sure felt boundless. Okay. Let's play Monsters and Humans. What are you, precisely? What? What are you doing? This place is weird. Hmm. Beautiful. Well, back to business. The library B. Sands. Let's save again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Determination, determination. Uh, this is a box. You can put an item in it or take it out. Why would you, though? You can't use items when they're in the box. Sincerely, a box hater. That's rude. Um. Yeah. Wait. Can I, like. Oh my god. Mini games, mini games. Easy. Um, alright. Noir esque suddenly. V um. Uh, hi, Undyne. I'm here with my daily report. Uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. Huh? Did I fight them? I yes, of course I did. I, I fought them valiantly. What? Did I capture them? W well. No, I tried very hard, Undyne, but in the end, I failed. What? You're going to take the human soul yourself? But, but Undyne, you don't have to destroy them, you see. You see. I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. Papyrus, I trusted you. Oh, shit. Not even close, baby. We out. Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome. I'm so jealous. What you do to get her attention? Haha. <laughs> Come on, let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. Uh, a feeling of dread hangs over you. But you stay determined. Alright. When four bridge seeds align in the water, they will sprout. Alright. Okay. Man, building bridges sure is easy. Wonderful technology. Can't read that sign. Um. Alright, Aaron. Ah, uh, flex. You flex. Aaron flexes twice as hard. Attack increases for you too. Flexing contest. Okay, flex more. Oh my god, Johnny Bravo, stop. Oh my god, oh my god. Aaron is ready for your next flex. You flex harder. Aaron flexes thrice as hard. Nice, I won't lose though. Winky face. Ah! Aaron is ready for your next flex. You flex. Aaron flexes very hard. He flexes himself out of the room. You won. God bless Aaron. 
can't read the sign, and it's very upsetting to me. Um... This is, this is not gonna make four. Does it need to be four exactly? Evidently so. Can I just like put one here? Is that kosher? No, it's not at all kosher. Uh, what does this say? If an error is made, the bell blah 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 blah, blah figured that out. Alright, let's see. Let's do some math here real quick. Congratulations. You failed the puzzle. Fuck! You got me. Hook, line, and sinker. Easy. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. How did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. Yeah. So, uh, what are you wearing? Um, Papyrus, I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a bandana. Is that true? Are you wearing a bandana? Y yes. So you are wearing a bandana. Got it. Wink, wink. Have a nice day. Papyrus, I trusted you. Wishing room. A long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes to the stars in the sky. If you hoped with all your heart, your wish would come true. Now all we have are these sparkling stones on the ceiling. Damn. Thousands of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. Fuck. What's going on here exactly? Clean? Uh, f uh green means clean. Uh, if tears are sanity- whoa. Uh... God, um... Come on, sis, make a wish. I wish my sister and I will see the real stars someday. Look through the telescope? Yes. Check wall. Um... Where? Ah, seems my horoscope is the same as last week's. Okay, it's said to check the wall, but there's like a lot of wall here? This wall, maybe? No. There's a lot of wall in here. Alright, didn't seem to have any effect. Oh, okay. Well, I gotta figure that out. Alright. Ancient writing covers the wall. You can just make out the words. The war of humans and monsters. Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seemed that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. It would take ne the soul of nearly every monster just to equal the power of a single human soul. But humans have one weakness. Ironically, it is the strength of their soul. Its power allows it to persist outside the human body, even after death. If a monster defeats a human, they can take its soul. A monster with a human soul, a horrible beast with unfathomable power. It's an illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about this drawing. Oh, alright, uh, and we're in the void. And we're not in the void anymore. Shadows. Um. Ah, <clears throat> uh, ah, uh, oh fucking hell. Christ, fuck. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm being assailed. Ah. Oh god. Oh fuck. Dog, not now. Oh, 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 Lord. Oh, my God. Open the menu. Open the menu. Oh, God. I can't seem to open the menu. I, I'd rather you did not be doing this.
Good talk, team. And we out. Get. Stop. Yo, did you see that? Undyne just touched me. I'm never washing my face ever again. Man, are you unlucky. If you were just standing a little bit to the left. Oh, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see her again. Good talk. This cheese has been here so long, a magical crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. Squeak. Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the mystical crystal, it fills you with determination. Alright, off we go. Sands, busy as always, I see. I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally 5,000 gold to use this premium telescope, but... Whoa, 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 whole antivirus, calm down. There's no need to take the entire window away. But, since I know you, you can use it for free. How's about it? Uh, sure. Uh, quite thrilling. Quite thrilling. Yeah, um, you know, I don't pick up very many items. What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? Wait a second, did I have a black eye? Guess not. Oh, hey, cool dude. I relocated my store, but there are still no customers. Fortunately, I've thought of a solution. Punch cards. Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can trade them for a free ice cream. They're sure to get the customers to come back. Uh, sure. Um, I'll do it. I've, I'm all about deals. Yes. I'm um, thrilling. Uh, oh, alright. The ancient glyphs have been painted over with a list of 21 different flavors. Interesting, interesting. Alright, let's venture off into the trippy place.